The woman accused of setting more than 60 fires on the eastern shore made a move in court today you might find surprising. 10 on your side's Deanna LeBlanc was in Virginia Beach for Tanya Bundick's third trial. Deanna? Yeah, Katie, we expected to be in court for a trial on just one of those arson charges, but instead, Tanya Bundick entered an Alford plea on all remaining 61 charges. Now, that means she's not pleading guilty, but is entering an Alford plea of guilt because she knows the Commonwealth has enough evidence to find her guilty. Now, Bundick was sentenced to seven years for this plea. When you add that to the seven years and the three and a half year terms she was already sentenced for for previous charges, that's a total of 17 and a half years she will serve behind bars. Now, remember, Bundick could have had 60 more trials for each individual count and could have possibly, at the extreme, have served more than 500 years behind bars. Now, Bundick's attorney did mention in court today that she hoped the judge would keep in mind that none of the homes that burned had people living in them. They were all vacant. But a victim I spoke with in court today says that doesn't make the crime any less serious in his eyes. This house, and I'm sure many other houses on the Eastern Shore, have a story. So this house was rich in family history. It was bought for an aunt who raised my family and did so much for her family. And not living on the shore, but hearing how people were literally terrorized and people were afraid for so long, I'm just happy that I could uh, not be a part to make sure that I was. it was important for me to be here. And that's James Sample again. He was in court thinking there would be a jury trial just for his family's home. But again, Tanya Bundick entering an Alford plea on all remaining 61 arson charges. That's 52 felonies and nine misdemeanors. Now coming up tonight, starting at four, hear from the Commonwealth's attorney from Accomack County on why he decided this plea was a good deal. Live in Virginia Beach, I'm Deanna LeBlanc. Ten on your side. Now, Bundick's being tried in Virginia Beach instead of Accomack County because a judge believed the fires really affected the Eastern Shore community and it would have been difficult to find an impartial jury.